Hi everyone, this is Linda. Welcome to my channel. Today guys, I have a Hobby Lobby clearance haul for you guys. It is an art clearance. Um, went to Hobby Lobby yesterday. Yes, I know, on the 4th of July. Wasn't sure I wanted to go because of the traffic, but I said I gotta go. So I wanted to see if there was anything. I called beforehand. They said they started to mark down their items for the art department last week so I went and boy did I find some bargains so I'm going to get started so the first thing I want to show is I got a Faber-Castell Pitt Artist Pen it is in opaque white regular $4.99 down to $0.99 cents. so I'm anxious to try that I don't have any of these pens so I'm thinking these are going to be pretty good so, next item, I got me um, some of these little palette cups for oil painting. Um, regular $3.79 for $0.94, cents. and it's a dual. So, you just clip that right on your little palette, and you put your um, linseed oil or whatever inside. Okay, and, and boy, I found the brushes, guys. So, I'm just going to get started showing you these. These were regular $7.99 for $1.99. And these for water, acrylic, or tempera. So I got that little pack. And then this pack here, regular $8.99 for $2.24. These are all for um, acrylic, water, and tempera. Regular $9.99 for $1.99. This one is regular $9.99, and for some reason this was $1.37. Um, it's very similar to this one, um, but it's telling me this is an 18, and this says 3 fourths, but boy, they look very familiar, um, very similar, I want to say. I just, this is a little longer, but anywho, I'll, I'll use them. Okay, next is, this is an all-purpose pack, and it is um, $6.99, was $4.99, down to $1.24. $1.24! I, I can't get over the pricing. Oh my gosh, and the paints. Guys, I, I was there yesterday, and they had so much paint. I... I needed a thousand dollars to get everything that I wanted. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Um, but you know, I didn't. I didn't spend no way near that. But anyway, um, six ninety nine for dollar seventy four for this pack. All right, and move it on. I got this little pack of all um, all purpose watercolor acrylic tempera. $4.99 to $1.24. And then this big pack here, um, $8.99 for $2.24. Look at the size of those. A size 12, a 24, another 24, and a 12. Oh my goodness. I just. And I think, guys, I heard one of the um, workers yesterday saying that she had new stock for our supplies. So I think they are either replenishing or rebranding their um, their uh, items in the art I'm not sure but you know I, so I I get in there yesterday I have to tell you this little story I get in there yesterday and oh my gosh I found the, the paints you know I was done looking through the paint and I look over I said where's those brushes so I went I found the brushes and then down the aisle on both sides of the aisle it says do not enter and they had these big white um, blockers on both sides of the aisle. And I thought, you got to be kidding me. I got to get down that aisle. And all I seen was orange stickers everywhere. So I went up front to where they do the framing. And I said, is there any way I could look at your brushes? She goes, oh, she goes, yes. She goes, we had did the floors. And there's still some of the wax still in puddles, a little bit waxy. But she um, opened it up. She goes, if anybody sees you down here you tell them I let you through there but I can't remember the girl's name but anyway um, 
I, I got to go through and I was so happy oh my gosh but that's when I found all these brushes so I thought I wasn't gonna get to go down there ow I said I'm going down that aisle but oh my gosh anyway here's another pack that I found this is the only great big pack that I got with all of these in it this was $9.99 for $2.49 but look guys look how many brushes and there's the brush guide Oh my, I am well stocked for brushes, I'm telling you. Okay, so here's the paint. Now, I didn't get a whole lot of paint, although I wanted a whole lot of paint. I knew, because um, I have enough to do me a lifetime, because <laughs> I buy paint. That's what I buy. Some women buy shoes, some women buy makeup, clothes. I buy art supplies with my, that's what I do. So here's the what we have. I'm going to move this out of the way. Um, we have the thick body acrylic is on sale, regular $9.99. Well, actually on clearance for $2.49. $2.49. Oh my gosh. And I have already several some of these, and I like this paint very well. So here's the colors that I got. I've got the light green, a bright aqua blue. Isn't that beautiful? And then I got the brilliant blue and the light blue violet and Naples yellow and then I got the light blue permanent now this is in a different um, packaging and I've never seen this packaging before and I don't know if it's something that's been here or something that is just coming but um, my old packaging, I mean my older one, I had this color and it's like this. So I don't know. But anyway, let me know if you have these in your store. I'm just curious. So another color I got was Ultramarine Blue and this is the green shade. And then the permanent, or a brilliant purple. So those are the colors that I picked um, with their brand. Okay. And then I picked, I picked a few more in the Grumbacker Academy, which is a deep violet. It's really pretty. Then I got this other blue. I, you can tell this is my one of my favorite colors. I keep buying it every time I'm out. And then I got the um, cobalt blue. These were $5.99 for $1.49. But they had oil paint. And they had watercolors. Oh, I can't get it. and they had so much stock it was like not getting low at all oh my I just and it takes me so long to get there because we live just shy of two hours away from my nearest Hobby Lobby so it's it is a trip and a half to go but um, another item I found was this um, beginning lettering set so um, I don't letter per se um, but it's $9.99 for $2.49 and I thought, you know, I could learn to do a little bit of this in my journaling and, um, give it a try. If not, I can use this for mark making or for, um, just sketching, you know, because there's a 4-H pencil in there and there's some of these regular markers and I can see that they have some brush tip nibs and... I know this one does because it's showing me a brush. So um, I'll, I'll try it. We'll see how it goes. And then, okay, here is some of their um, round pastel sticks. Regular $20, $19.99 for $4.74. So I'm in this section, okay, and I'm looking at these and I look down and I see their little blocks of uh, pastels, the soft pastels. And it said $49 cents 49 i'm thinking mm -mm, nope that's not right and i and i i put it in my buggy and i thought you know i don't think this is right so i did ask one of the workers they re-double checked and here it was supposed to be 14.90 huh somebody had messed up on their um pricing but it was okay i i was going to get them from my kids camp but um but anywho i've got some but there's those all right let's see what else we got um okay so this was um on sale for 40 percent off 
So this is a Master's Touch um, watercolor journal and it's 140 pound acid free and this is the cutest thing because this is like velvet or felty it's, it's small uh, like a smooth surface and then you open it and then here's the pages I love working in this size or even smaller but they're nice and sturdy and then it also has this little gum that goes around it it's an 8 by 5 with 48 pages um, regular $8.99 and then I got it for like 40% off of that so um, and, and the worker at the checkout she goes oh this is cute so I thought yeah I like that and it was the only one so I grabbed it okay and then I was able to get let me see oh here's one more in the artsy stuff I got the Liquitex basic acrylic iridescent medium you can use this alone um, to add a little sparkle to your work or you can add this um, to your paint or you can just put it on top of your finished work and I always like a thing that sparkles anyway I'm always adding sparkles so I got that regular $6.99 for $1.87 okay um, oh yes and then these I saw this on Stephanie's uh, Stephanie Garrett's channel and she had shown these um, on her channel and these are the color soft portrait pencils so you know I'm not going to use them for portraiture I don't I'm not that kind of an artist wish I was but I'm not um, but Derwent is a really good brand and look how they come guys they come in this little tin and you get a pencil sharpener and the colors are really pretty you get ochre you get dark terracotta you get brown earth and these beautiful pink shades these would be good for drawing um, and shading some florals and that's why I got these so these are very very nice pencils because you know Derwent's expensive and these are $9.49 for $2.49 Oh my goodness, it was such a good buy. And that was the only one that was left. So, um, there is that. And then, um, ta-da! I was able to find these. So I took it out of the package already. This was regular $29.99, and I got it for $7.49. So, um, and you get this little paper on the front that tells you about it. It's genuine leather. And it says it's handcrafted from Indian buffalo leather. leather. And um, so I opened it up already. And I want to show you inside. The pages are beautiful. Handmade paper. And they are very nice. Very, very nice. So I did uh, pick up two of these. I was debating on just getting one. But I thought, you know, I remember how they looked. Um, actually, I saw this on Stephanie Garrett's channel again, um, and I just loved it. But you know, on camera, the book does not, it doesn't, doesn't give it justice, guys. Um, the camera just doesn't pick up. And it looks a lot smaller on camera. So, um, and anyway, the pages are deckled. And this would be so nice to um, do some sketching in. And... Um, you know, I, I could paint in this, but have to prime the pages. But it's so, so pretty. And I thought, this is lovely. So, I got that. And, um, the other one, I'll show. This is what it looks like when you're searching. It has this plastic on it, and it has the price right down in front. And you can see it was, sorry for the glare, it was too... $29.99 for $7.49. So there's those. Okay. And um, I did get me one of these for $0.99. Cents. This is curated a color. This is your art storage cups. And um, these are good for if you're making your own color and you want to keep it um, to store it in here. So that's a good idea. 
and it's three ninety nine ninety nine cents. So really nice, nice and sturdy too. All right, and then um, one other thing, which I saw on Stephanie's channel again. And if you're not following Stephanie Gear, please go give her a follow. Oh my gosh, she has so many good videos on hauls, and she makes jewelry, and she's a mixed media artist, and I love her channel. So, um, here is some rice paper I got. I only got one. Um, regular $17.99 for $4.49. And this is good for calligraphy, just sketching, watercolor. Um, it is on the lighter side. The paper's not real um, heavy. But that's okay. I um, I haven't even touched my gel printing plates, and I'm wanting to do that, and I'm want to try it with this. So be watching for those videos coming out. I see a lot of people transferring, um, like with their inking um, pages from a magazine, and the imaging is transferring to the paper. So I wanted to try that. I don't know how well it's going to work, but um, I think you have to use a certain magazine too. But so there's that, and then another thing I got was, this was in the spring section, and their spring stuff is 66% off. So this was regular $10.99, and I got it for like $2.72, but I love these clear storage bins, and I'll use them here in the studio. Um, so there's that, and the last item I got, and I really debated like when it was in my buggy to get this and I'm thinking oh just get it because when you get home you're gonna regret it so I'm gonna hold it up here and show you guys so if you can see the picture on here right there let me get it down here a minute so you can see the gray here what this is and it is so big I can't hardly get it underneath the camera I'm knocking over my light so what this is is a grid for the wall. I'm going to hang this up on the wall. Of course, you know, it'll be vertical. And let me let me take this paper off to show you guys better. And I can set this big thing down. So hold on one second. So here's the photo. So what I want to do is I'm going to hang this on the wall and hang my paints with a clip on each one of these little um, runs that go across. So probably be every other one, but this being as big as it is, I'm going to be able to hold a lot on there. So um, this was on uh, just at the half off. Okay, so it's 24 by 24, and the regular price was 34.99, and I got it for 17. So, uh, it was like I said, I had it in the buggy, and I was like, should I get this, or should I go back and buy more paints? So, um, and I debate with that. I'm thinking, ah, oh, should I get that, or, I mean, I can always put my stuff in something else. But I like to have it on display, and I like to just be able to walk up and grab the paint I need, instead of going through drawers and fishing for them. So, I thought this would be good for that, and then, you know, if I decided not to use it for that anymore... I'll put it probably in the kitchen or as a memo um, holder, but um, I'm happy with it though, and I'm glad I got it. So, okay, so that is my haul, guys. That is everything that I got um, on this trip. I don't know if I'll be making a second trip. Like I said, I live almost two hours away from my closest Hobby Lobby, which I hate. Oh, Hobby Lobby, please come closer to my area come closer to western maryland past hagerstown into cumberland into the Vale. but anyway um i'm rattling now guys i'm rambling so thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed the video please give me a thumbs up if you made it this far let me know down below and say i watched the whole video um and Go check out your Hobby Lobby because, oh my goodness, the deals are unending in the art department because this is wonderful. And I thank you for watching. Until next time, guys, stay tuned. 
I will see you soon. Bye-bye, guys.